is up, crew? It's your boy, the RPG Prodigy, and I'm back again with another episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation. In the last episode, we went exploring the east side of Girin City, and we encountered a few interesting things. One being a girl who shot through her roof. And we're gonna be going and looking into that, but before we do, I wanna show you guys something. I went out to Oceana Pier, and I noticed that the lady that was feeding the fledglings disappeared, and I picked this up a fledgling. Apparently, if you go down there, you can just talk to them and you can battle them. It has Gale Wings, makes it really good for us. We give priority on our flying type moves. But other than that, the team is pretty much the same. Trunk's still level 15. And, yeah. The last time I remember, she said she wanted a Petcha Berry. So let's get the Wedge of Petcha Berry. I do thank you guys for following along with me. If you guys have any advice or ideas, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Uh, I believe her house was down here. If I remember correctly. Yeah, it was right here. Look at her. Face planted into the dirt. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna be switching Fletchling into the front because I actually want to level it up before the first gym, I could probably guess. Okay, what you guys say? You Got me a petcha berry? Yes, wench. Got you a petcha berry. Thank you. Even though we just met, it feels like we've been friends for a lifetime. But this is the end for me. I can see the light on the horizon. If only I was able to have one last orange berry too. Goodbye. This fucking wench. Yeah, uh, you can leave whenever you want. I ain't moving. I'm gonna need to bury your body later. Seriously, you don't have to just stand there. Just let me die alone. No. You're not buying this for a second, huh? Not even! Alright, alright, I give up. So, my name is VNAM. Remember it. You probably thought it was Veronica because my mom, because of my mom, but it's VNAM. Or Venom. Call me Veronica, and you'll need more than an orange berry to heal your wounds. Veronica, come at me. <laughs> anyway, it looks like I got kicked out again. This happens on a weekly basis, so I'm not too concerned. I play music too loud, I get kicked out, and then I get some poor sap to buy me free food. So does that mean you're the poor sap this time around? I'ma kick your butt. Watch what you say, girl. <laughs> I'm just teasing you. You don't have to look at me like that. Hey, why don't you come hang out with me and my friends? I promise you it'll be fun. My friends are more responsible than me, so it won't go bad. Eh, sorry about that, Kuri just flew by again. Okay, so basically we can find them by going directly south here. If you don't show up, I'll find you and demand that you buy me more food. And I assure you that I have expensive tastes all around. You ain't getting no more food from me, girl. <sighs> okay. No, Veronica, I'm not letting you inside yet. Go away. Damn. Bro, your mama cold. Okay, she said you could find her by going south. Are she doing this again? That poor, old, wet, wretched woman. My mother has done it again. I have been fatally wounded. I can't go on anymore. All I uh, ask for before I pass the Barry Emporium or it Barry. I need the taste of the succulent, beautiful, empowering taste of the orange berry. Please, just do it for me. Cut it out, Ven Venom. It's Ren. You've tried this one on me before. Please. Honestly, just get up, Venom. Or should I say, Veronica? Yo, call me Veronica! Yeah, yeah, just open the door. Ren, you're horrible. You and Brent and a dying girl's wish? You're a girl? Could've fooled me. Oh! I gotta give Ren some burn points. Nice, nice. Mugen, do you see how this guy treats me? It's awful. Oh, Mugen is here. 
Yep, sup, Ren? I thought I was wondering where you went off to, but I guess you, these were your friends you were gonna meet up with? Is this the one you were talking about before? Yes, it is! They granted me a dying girl's wish, unlike someone we know. Whatever. Sounds like you guys already know each other, so I'm so I'm skipping. Introductions. Resto! Let's -a go, go, go! You know what? This works out well for everyone. Sorry for eavesdropping, but I heard the professor talking to you about meeting Mel Melia in the forest. Don't waste your time. She's not there right now. There's an old power grid that the city still uses despite the actual sewer system being abandoned. Recently, it was shut down by an unknown source. Melia decided she wanted to see if she could fix it herself. Professor Jenner is good with mechanics, so I bet he's taught her a, f um, a good few things. Anyway, we shouldn't keep the ladies waiting. Let's go. Alright. Alright, squads. Let's go. Welcome to the abandoned sewers. This is the lobby. We're basically we are basically there, yeah? The abandoned sewers is a place where a ton of trainers come to level up their Pokemon. <laughs> Believe it or not, I may need some help getting through the sewers myself. Don't worry. With my strength, everyone will quiver in fear of the mere sight of us. That was a joke. Yeah, come on. Let's go. Alright, I guess we tag team him with Ren, though. Oh, Pokemon in the open. Oh, it's the trash. Usually I'd skip these, but I kind of really want to level up my, um, fletching. Not the poison gas! You suck! Hit up with that quick attack! I hope we get a flying type move soon. Not spikes! Your mother! Alright, good, good, good. We're getting up the end of levels. I guess we talked to Ren. Man, I wish they would clean out the sewer water soon. Oh wait, they can't. The authorities don't know about this place. That is a bit weird. I'll let it be. What's up? New friends of Venom? How exciting! Luca, we're just trying to get to the grid. Could you quiet it down a bit? Nope, time to battle! Wow! Alright, alright. Square up time. Dude, I'm scared. On my fletchling. Walk around. <laughs> you jerks are gonna pick on my fletchling. Also chat, or also guys, I gotta ask you this real quick. If you guys have an idea for a name for the Fletchling, um, leave it in the comment section below. I actually would like to see what you guys' ideas would be. Level 10. And it learned... Good, 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 good. Oh 
Oh, yawn at me. And I fell asleep. Oh shit. Hey, that clutch. Welcome. I bet you'll fit just fine around me. Fitting just fine around here. Darn it! I lost. Oh well. Say hi to Venom for me. Let me see if he just auto heals our Pokemon. Yep. Man's just auto heals our Pokemon. Uh. Hit him up. Get that great ball. Low on Radita. At least I know they got a some big variety down here. Who else we found on here? That is a garbage! What you got? You two possess enough strength. I need to test out my analysis. What you mean, cuz? And that is my cue to switch out Fletchling. He's too electric that Pokemon. None of that. I find it interesting that it's the um the voiceover for P the actual Pikachu from the anime. I find that to be actually pretty cool. You were gonna use Thunder Shock on my Fletchling, you ass. And you paralyzed me. Double mean! And now collect these rock collect this freezer, bro. Stop growling at me. You're being very rude. Ah, the paralyzed. Uh Man, this is gonna be a bit annoying. And he paralyzes you too? Uh, that luck is with them real strong. Come on. And both of us got paralyzed this turn? Aw, oh, man! He's paralyzed again. Wow. Talk about some luck on your side. Collect this crap! Hmm. I see. I understand. Have a nice day. That's all you gotta say to me, cuz? Really? Okay, nothing over here. What up, what up? Hmm. Oh, pardon me. I was just wondering how one would get to the other side here. There doesn't seem to be a way from this area. Interesting. Probably a hint of some kind that you can open up a bridge. Luciana and Ekin. Still don't see any interesting mons to catch. You guys say, sometimes wild Pokemon will appear out of the grass. Sometimes wild Pokemon that appear out of the grass won't respond to you until you feed them. The best way to feed them is to use gourmet treats. They're quite expensive, so you should save up a lot of money. Okay, thanks for the advice. Pokemon battles are so easy. Aren't... Oh, po yeah. Aren't I just the cutest? No. No, you ain't. Oh, that free EXP wrapped up, though. Hit him up with that priority move pack. And the burn! That's just insulting. No! My priority powers! I, a part of me wishes that they change Gale Wings to as long as the Pokemon's HP is above half, it gives it priority. 
So I guess that would be beaten way too nice. So I'll, I'll, I'll give them what they got. They, they, they did a good job reworking this because Galewings used to be really busted. Even I have to admit it. Galewings used to be really strong on um on flexing and putting them into evolutions. Like every single flying type move just automatically goes first no matter what. That is that is way too strong. Gene. Agility. Now, I don't think teaching it agility is going to help much because Fletching is already pretty fast on its own. Misty Bowl. Mystery Bowl. What's this? Uh, Mystery Bowl. A weird concoction of ingredients. It smells goodish. I don't trust it. Not even for a second. Um, let's see. Oh, I found Venom! You guys took your sweet ass time. I've been wi I'm withering away over here. Man, whatever. This is where we're supposed to be. We didn't take t that long, did we? Don't be so impatient. Alright, then. Let's go meet them, yeah? Oh, you gotta be. Did the power seriously just flicker again? That's so infuriating. They locked us out and locked Melian and, Melia and Vel Venom in. It. The generator should be somewhere around here. Let's just reset it ourselves. Okay, that gives you more insight to search. Hmm. I came down here to run away from the police. So what if I stole something from the Berry Emporium? She has so many berries in stock that she won't even notice the difference. Wow. That's exactly what a thief would say. Viking is my life. So is Pokemon. Alright, respect what you got, cuz. Yeah. Oh, I see free XP. That priority pet, no! Yeah, no, cuz. You ain't. Oh, oh, okay, for a second I thought he was coming at me with them arm thrusts. I'm seeing twice. <laughs> Man, he's just giving growl up the hands. All right, look like this quick. <laughs> I see we share similar interests. That we do, my brother. That we do. Okay, what the heck was that all about? Turns here are actually tougher than I thought they would be. Ren, shut up. Oh, thank you for the antidote. Thanks, cuz. Oh, we're right at this. Oh, dude, you're arrested. Let's get moving. I know some of you are thinking, why don't I just pop a rebel, but I don't feel like it just yet. I thought something might be in there. Huh, where's this? Want some cheap food? Buy yourself a bowl down here. What do we use to make it? You don't want to know. That makes me want to know. This food is kind of gross, but let's battle anyway. Oh, what does that have to do with the food? Alright, um, let's try this. Put him up with a pet. Red Crypto! I 
I just noticed this, like, almost every person that we've fought so far has just been going after Growlithe with a fiery passion. Level 14. And we're not looking too bad. Fletching is really, really fast. I give it that. Oh, you're Froakie level 12. I've been wondering about that. Like, if your Grout is level 10, I've been wondering, like, how strong is your Froakie? And slapped. I wanted to win. Oh, well. Let's forget this ever happened. No, you squared up and you lost. Ain't forgetting it. Welcome to... Shurik... Shurik, dudes? Wine and dine with one of a kind. That is, if you call Chinese food wine and dine. You like some? You. You change your mind, come back. I'm sick and tired of Venom walking around like she owns the place. One day this place is going to be mine, and no one's going to do a thing about it. What, cuz? It's the random PC in here, I guess. Gotta go on the other side. Uh, I guess that must be where we go to turn it on. You're in the corner, cuz. Thank you, I, I guess. No use being poisoned all the time. I, I guess. Huh. Oh, so this is the generator. Yeah, this looks like the place. What do we have to do to reset the generator again? I think Melia told me how to do it once. It went something like 3 plus 1 plus 2 is the solution to our generator reset problems. 6. But what could that even mean? Those numbers together equal 6. But is that relevant? Perhaps we need to activate the generators in a certain order. 3 plus 1 plus 2. 3 plus 1 plus 2. Great job, Mugen! You did it! 3 plus 1 plus 2. It was so simple. Third generator, then the first generator, then the second generator. I was looking way too into it. Alright, now that that's all said and done, we should go meet up with Melly and Venom. Yep, yep, let's go! <laughs> On my nearest convenience, I am going to get some repels. Alright, I feel like something big's gonna happen, so let's save the game right here, crew. Yeet. I need more nutrients, please. Feed me an orange berry. At this point, I feel like you're doing this just to be annoying. Annoying? What are you talking about? Venom? I'm trying to focus here. Could you quiet down a bit? Yeah, I know, but... I'm so bored right now! Are you done fiddling with that computer yet? Unfortunately, it's a super negative. That, that's a super negative. I can't pinpoint the source of the error. It's hopeless. I'll never figure it out. Maybe I should just... Oh! Have we met before? You look familiar. Oh, it's the girl that bumped into us. When we when we entered Jenner's lab. Huh? Have you met Mugen already? Mugen, this is Melia, the professor's daughter. Oh yeah, you're the one I bumped into on my way out of the lab. I was on my way to the forest, but the rail net was closed due to some power failures. Well, trip's cancelled. Let's go back home and do nothing. Aw, that's a shame, but I guess I can always go tomorrow. As long as we're here, we should check up on our experiment. You mean those trash bags you left lying around? Yep. It's been a few days, so we should check it out. 
Red, could you explain to Mugen what we're talking about? Oh yeah, sure. Mugen, Melian was trying to see if the rumors about Trubbish and Garbodor are true. If you leave trash in, um, in Phil for a few days, there's a chance it will mutate into Pokemon. Interesting. Yeah, but it's not all. That's not all we're testing. We're here to put Melia's hidden ability to the test. Venom, I don't have any hidden abilities. Stop saying things that are just not true. You have a bunch of shiny Pokemon. No one else has this luck. It's a hidden ability, and that's that. Ah. <sighs> I'm sure that experiment will be a failure anyway. There's no way trash bags can mutate into Pokemon in the first place. Then just check already. Where are the trash bags? They're not around here. That's strange. Holy! No way! Is that a Garbodor? It's eating the wiring. I bet they're the reason the power has been all over the place. Wait. The color of that Garbodor is strange, isn't it? Garbodors are usually green, but this one is purple. It's shiny, just like I said it would be. There are two trash bags I placed up. There they are! Where did the Garbodor go? Oh. Garb! Don't worry, Melia. Mugen and I will take care of this. Alright. Squirrel! We'll take care of this, Melia. Just leave it to us. Right. I'm sorry about this. Squirrel! Hit him with that pick dog! We already poison crew! I'm gonna work. I like this music. Hey. How much damage these things do? You see what I mean? They are just going in on fucking Growlithe. Yeah, I think we're gonna lose the growl at this turn. What the? Oh, aftermath! I I really hate aftermath so much. Hit him up with the pack. Not the power. Oh, that's actually pretty scary. Ah, oh, and fletching went down. All right, Trump, get in there. Give him some help. I already well know that it's a poison type, so using grass type moves ain't gonna help us much right here. So we gotta hit him up. With that tackle. Okay, crew, we kill next turn. Oh, that quick attack for the kill, though, and level 16. You're, you're mine. Easy. You two, you two should go on and think about what you've done. You can't just attack people because you want to. Thanks, Ren and Mugen. That was it. 
You guys have a nice have nice synergy together. Did you know that? Anyway, we weren't in any real danger to begin with, huh? Why is that? Well, because we have this. Wow, what is it? It's a briefcase. My father gave it to me right before I left. I opened it earlier and it holds things like potions and stuff like that. But my father told me to enter a secret code if things got ba really bad out here. If things got bad, all I would have to do is enter the code and we would be safe. At least, I think we would be. Uh, okay then. In any case, we found the source of the power problems. Some engineers should be here soon to fix the broken pipes and wiring around the grid. Things should be back to normal in no time at all. I'm going to stay here and supervise, I guess. It's not like I can go back anyway. I got kicked out again, you see? Have fun with that, I guess. You're a new trainer, right, Mugen? Would you like to accompany me to Goldenwood Forest? It's a place a lot of newbie trainers go to practice their skills and become stronger. I'm going there for research, but you could probably benefit from the trip as well. If you're interested, meet me on Route 1. You can get there by taking the North Rail Net. I'll be on my way. Hey now. Later, Melia. Well, Mugen, I gotta run as well. Let's go out. Let's get out of here. Oh, I like that they drop you on the outside. I have some research to do for the professor, so I'll be at Magnolia Library. Remember that the Northern Railnet is located on the northwest part of Girin. If you get lost, just follow the purple strips on the road and you'll find it eventually. See you soon! Hi, hi. We travel. Alright, we said the northwest. So I'm guessing past the bridge where that guy was. Alright, let's take a look at our team. Did, did they at least heal our Pokemon before? Okay, yeah, yeah, they did. We still good, crew. We still good. All right. Before we continue on, let's get some potions. And I'm gonna need to replace that Pokeball I used to catch on um, the Fletchling. All right. Remember what I said last time, crew? We'll be going for that rematch. But not today, in the next episode. <laughs> Just kidding. Anyway, crew, I'll be catching you again. This is going to be where I'm going to cut the recording. Um, if you guys have any ideas for the name for the Fletching, just leave it in the comment section below. I'll take it up to consideration. Anyway, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. And I'll catch you later. Peace out. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me. Even if it's